Hey guys, welcome back. So, um, yeah, so I just watched the A and D one. Oh, well, actually, I watched it a few days ago. So that one's a shorter one because it's not a very um in depth um keynote. Unlike the others, the others are like an hour or so, hour now hour, hour and a half. Um, this one was like twenty two minutes, and all they really announced was a few small product things. For example, the um the eight thousand series. Um, I'm guessing CPUs. Um, along with the um the in built graphics. Um. <clears throat> Sorry guys, I seriously, seriously should be over this nerve, being nervous so much. Um, but yeah, um, that's really in the short detail what they already released today. They didn't give us too much. I think the um, one of the um, products they did release was the was the eighty. Can't remember if it was eighty four or eighty fifty. Uh, I believe that it's, that's their um, graphics processing unit. So I think I believe it was the APUs. Um, they did release a growth card, I believe. Oh, it's a newer growth card. I just can't remember the name of it. I uh, was going to watch the video, the video recorded, and do that. Uh, fortunately, when I record the video, the um, I'll just say I've got to fix up how I record videos because some of the input sound going in. Because I've got sound coming from my my. Um, If it's the sound can go, it goes up and down the volume because I have different sources for it. I've got to figure out a way to make the sources a bit more, um, well, exactly the same. So I think there is a way to do that. I just got to figure out, figure out how to do that on OBS. But yeah, um, they did, did talk about their new, um, how more efficient their um, CPUs and APUs and all that shit's going to be. Um, the NPUs, I'm really hearing that word a lot. NPUs, guys, I, in two, like, four or five days ago, I never heard of them. I, not once in my life I heard of them. I mean, I've heard of AI, obviously. I went to uni many years ago, and they were talking about the beginning of AI. Um, I didn't realise how far AI has gotten, to be, be honest. But I can see they're starting to put them into their processing, their processes, their graphics, and everything else they sell. So um, I'm pretty happy on that. I mean, I'd like to see how far AI can go. I mean, there's a lot of people out there who are really scared because... Are we going to have an, uh, like an iRobot situation where we're going to have some sort of nerve um, taking over the world or some shit like that? I imagine there's going to be some security things in place just in case something like that happens. So if it's something a machine decides to go rogue, we can easily um, deal with it. But we wouldn't have to worry about that. Not for years in a way. Probably not another five or ten years at least. I mean, we've got a long way. But yeah, guys, I'm pretty happy to see the AMD Ryzen, or AMD in general, doing fairly well because... It's the thing, guys. Before I bought my upgrade my new computer, I had the AMD FX. So you probably never heard of the FX. That's how old it is. And it was a good CPU. Um, it wasn't the best CPU. I could have, should have got the one before it because that one was basically the same CPU. The only difference with this one was it's overclocked or by default, um, and you need a water cooler to keep it cool. That was it. That was the only difference. Um, when you're talking about efficiency, yeah, it wasn't that good. Um, Intel was doing so much better with the i7s and i5s and shit. So that's the stuff I would have recommended. Now, I think I need to really become a viable um, chip maker. So definitely, you can always choose Intel or AMD um, if you're doing computers and shit. Um, it would be nice to have a third one, but I think... Now, I'm not too sure. I think NVIDIA's got ideas on what they're going to be doing in that department, so I'll be keeping an eye out on that. And ARM, um, I'm not really a big ARM person because the processors are a bit differently designed than our current ones, especially um, now AMD and Intel by doing um, little core and big core kind of stuff. I wish I may do a video on in the future, just a breath um, explaining what they are. Um, I don't really explain too much. It's not too... I don't think it's too um, deep. But yeah, it's, there's a lot of stuff going around in tech, guys. And yeah, I feel kind of weird because I haven't been avoiding it for so long, but I actually kind of enjoy this doing this. I mean, yeah, I'm pretty happy, guys. I mean, I'm a bit down at the moment. I've just got a few videos to do. And yeah, once I catch up to everything, I'm going to start working on processes so we don't, I don't sound a bit off or get any information wrong in the future. So I probably have got a few things wrong and not on purpose it's probably just a mistake or got like, one of the other keynotes mixed up so yeah um yeah that's all i really want to talk about guys i think anything's doing well next one is nvidia and then i'm going to go back to sony and then i can start looking at the other what's left of them you know like i think a honda is in there i don't think it's going to be too much out of that 
If they're recent, I'll probably just make a small video or something. Um, I always make a video on them. It just depends on what's in them. I think D for example, is pretty short, so it's only worth a few minutes. So, um, yeah, I'm pretty happy to hear that, guys. I'm, I'm hoping AMD you will start going to more um, mobile devices. I know they've tried in the past and failed. Same with Intel. So, I. Uh, but yeah, we'll see what's that, what's how that will go. Um, Nvidia is going to be the next one because Nvidia is a big growth card maker, guys. There is, I'm going to say this, and a lot of AMD people are going to get mad. Nvidia just makes better graphics cards, but they're super expensive. Um, I don't think they're like AMD's worst graphics card manufacturer, and neither is Intel. Intel do make decent ones. They're so getting into the market. I'm just going to take them more before they become decent. Once they get really good, then then we'll have a free horse race, and that will be good for um, well, for the consumers, and yeah, maybe even business in the future, and maybe even um, Bitcoin. Um, I'm not really into Bitcoin mining and the shit because that's just garbage. So guys, I do put things into Bitcoin, but I don't. Do mining, I'd rather just put the money in there directly and do that shit. Anyway, guys, I'm gonna finish it. I want to finish it so I can get to the next one, get that out the way, and then move on. Cheers.